good Sunday, almost afternoon, boss. It's 11.32 yeah. on a Sunday. Yes, it is. Why does it look like I have, well, you have work attire on. I have my Sunday casual on. You didn't want to come to work? No. Boss is making me work, guys, on Sunday. There's a lot of rain coming, you guys, and we can't let this one go. So. Is that what the boss is telling you guys? I don't think that's true. We have to go away for a week. <laughs> you guys didn't know that. We kept it a secret all the way up until this video. Yeah. No, we told you we were going away to college. Me and Rachel are going to get more knowledge. No. Right? Yeah. We're both going to ECU. Yeah. We're <laughs> dropping our daughter off at ECU to start her freshman year in college. And I'm already a wreck. I'm sorry, boss. I know. You'll be okay. You'll get through this. I'll get through it. And it's really good for her. And I'm very proud of her. And, man, I'm extremely proud of all my kids. Mm -hmm. I just, um, your biggest goal is to raise productive little humans. <laughs> and I think I'm doing that. We're doing that. Yes. And it feels amazing. I feel very blessed. Yes, I do too. I mean, they're going to do good things. Paige already has her own business. Mm -hmm. We didn't officially announce it yet because we're waiting to get her DBA in the mail, but... I know. So we are excited, but she is official. She actually... Um, A 15-year-old entrepreneur, yeah, right? Yeah, 15-year-old entrepreneur. She has her first business, and um, it's doing very well. So if you yes, guys very well. don't know, um, it's actually she's on instagram she's on tiktok and it's mountain dog gear and we'll link everything again if you guys want to check it out some of you may even be already following her because... although i'm not sure we should shout it out because she's getting so many orders lately um she makes biothane dog leashes harnesses mm -hmm. collars and mm -hmm. she's just been a busy little bee with that little press if you guys remember we got her way back when she wanted to start this business yeah um and she's made, oh man, I, I I don't even know how many collars. She's probably made already like 50 or 60 collars, right? Yeah. Crazy, so, right? Yeah. I think even more than that, to Yeah, be maybe even more. She, she was excited. She got three, four orders today. Yeah. For collars. So, and yesterday, she and got a leashes. bunch yesterday, too. So, um, it's just amazing. So, we, you know, it, your children really do follow in your footsteps and, um, you have to model for them yes. the way that you just prefer and teach them to be better than us even us. yeah you know yeah that's my goal is like to even do better than we did you know but still have empathy and sympathy and stuff for people even though you're doing well off remember where you came from yeah absolutely um, definitely right so yeah so we are gonna get this mode and then we have to get home and um pack up yeah, but pick lots of tomatoes. Yes, and we don't have the 36 today. We lent it to a friend, um, Dave. Mm -hmm. um, hopefully you like it. Yeah, and hopefully you see how much more efficient you can be. That, oh, um, he's going to be more efficient, unless he gets the monsoon this week. I mean, we are we are supposed to get anywhere from 4 to like 10 inches. They're not even sure. Um, obviously, we won't be here, except for we will be back a couple days in the middle of the week, but we're not working. Yeah. We're completely off for a week. So we'll be in and out of the house because we got to honestly make two two trips back and forth to the coast mm -hmm. um, to move her back and forth in. So, it's going to be fun, you yeah. guys. So it's going to be it's fun. It's going to be a crazy, very emotionally and um, just physically draining week, I think. And, and we'll take you along every little yeah. bit of it because that's what we do. This um, is our life and thank you for following our journey. Yes, definitely. And so, if you don't know who we are, I'm Rachel. And I'm Carl and we're Happy's family. Yes. And we do mowing, 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 mowing and only mowing. Most of you have been watching us for years though and we really do appreciate that. <laughs> yes, we do appreciate you guys. So we'll take you on that trip out to the coast. We're going to get mowed here first. Mm -hmm. Um and then we'll get going. All right. So Rachel's finishing up over there. I'm doing all this. I'm gonna go weed eat now. And then we'll be done after she's done. The only other part she has to do is this field. So not bad, not bad. It didn't grow much in some parts. So we'll be done. Get back to the house and get ready. I couldn't wait to 
until we were done, man. It just couldn't wait until we were done. Like really, man, all we had to do is we'd eat the rest right here and there, and Rachel has to blow everything off. So of course, it's gonna be harder blowing now. Okay, let's get this done and hope this is just a light shower. Hello, boss. So we're back from mowing that big property you've seen. You didn't see much mowing. Um, we're doing more talking in this video, guys. Right now, we're out harvesting. We got, I think, over an inch of rain yesterday. Yeah. And all these tomatoes are going to pop if we leave them here. And they'll go bad because we are getting ready to leave. Right. Um, and about that. Yeah. This is the first time in 12 years of business, 11, 12 years, that we've ever taken a week off of work. Now we, we never ever we only planned you know vacations like going back and visiting family um winter because that's when we had off and we knew that um so we never ever ever took vacations in the summer and the kids knew that the kids knew that like it just wasn't that wasn't our season to play mm -hmm. um but yeah we, we kind of have to we have to do this there's no way around it um, it's going to be a big change for everybody and I want to give the kids like a couple good days, you know, of memories before they go back to school and I'm like mommy monster teacher. Yes. So this is going to be fun, but we're going to do it guys. We're going to make this happen. Um, but yeah, it's the first time in, in this long we've taken off during a mowing season. So yeah. needless to say. It was our luck that a tropical storm is coming up and it is going to dump a ton of rain here. We already like got tons. an inch. Yeah. So what's going to happen with the cool weather and a lot of rain when we're gone yeah. for that week? Well, the crazy thing is, is that you guys have been hearing us the past couple weeks say, we're so dry, we're so dry, we need rain, we need rain. And now we're going to get so much rain. Um, we already started seeing the lawns start to bounce back a little bit, yes, to be honest with you. because of the cool, especially where they've been getting rain up in Asheville. So you knew why we were like up against the wire with these past videos, making sure that we were really trying to stay on track. And for the most part, we did. Um, there's a couple that... Are going to go longer yeah. than, than they probably should, but... Needless to say, there'll be a lot of overgrown mowing when we yeah. get back. And I'm hoping that it's not a lot more rain when we come back. That would make things more, more difficult, but we're going to do it because we have to. Right, and I'm just thankful that this is, we're purposely taking this time off. Yes. We're purposely letting clients know, hey, this is what's going on. Um, and, you know, we're able to do that. It's not... You know, thankfully, it's not like, oh, my gosh, we just had an emergency. Yeah, thankfully. Yeah. So. So, knock on wood. Yes. We're going to hope for a great couple days and um, watch us go through the garden right now. And keep watching and you'll see us taking our first daughter to college. Yeah. Oh, sending gosh. her on her way. I don't even want to talk about it. So. Don't even want to talk about it. But we are going to be back and forth at the house. We're coming back here again during sometime in the week back and forth from the coast to the mountains yeah it's a lot of driving back and forth this week um we had to come back and get more stuff take care of animals and you know yes. all that yeah so just craziness but it's all right we're good we, we've got this we're yes. happy so follow us on our journey out there so, so please, please like, like comment and subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you know when we upload videos and be happy or at least try guys have a good night let's go pick up these uh let's go pick these tomatoes real quick we have pick actually, all the tomatoes the cherry tomatoes you can put in a bag to snack on in the car if you'd like the riper ones but we're gonna pick even the ones that are like do you want to do that no the oh, oh my goodness this whole branch is look at this tomato no, it's fine. I put it on there like that. Oh. Look at this tomato. Yeah, nice. Yeah, so we're taking all these to Nana's to give to her since we aren't going to use them. Yeah, nice, right? And you can eat some too. Hmm. I'll get some to eat. 
a little bit of blight on these cherries. Yeah, these ones do. These have had blight. You gonna come down in the garden? Okay, we don't have to, because we're coming back again. Yeah. In a day. So. Oh, did you want to eat them? I'm sorry, here. Okay, guys, so we're gonna take a walk down here and get, uh, oh, there's probably to me. There's probably tomatoes over here. Okay. Oh, wow, look. Uh, like rain gauges so that we can see how much rain we got. That one can go to the chickens. Oh, they're locked up. Oh man, look, there's some nice tomatoes in here, guys. Yeah. Okay, so we did get one and a half inches of rain almost. So I'm gonna dump this out. We remember that. That way I can see how many, how much rain we got when we come back. Probably five inches. So look at Rachel's hollyhock. <laughs> cool. Wow. What, honey? Wait, you okay, so wow -er. I know. So we have to pick these for your mom too. Oh, okay. But, um, but look, look at this loofah. Did you see this one? Did you oh see gosh. it? Come here. It's huge. Oh my! Look at it's this like thing. It's like the size of Chase's leg. Chase. What? Wow! Look how big this loofah is. Here, come hold Go. it. Come here. Go hold it. Well, come over here. This one is big. I just saw a butterfly. Rabbit? Did you just see a rabbit run? Was that a rabbit? Yeah. Look at how big this is, guys. This thing's huge. I just saw a butterfly the size of my hand. Was that a rabbit that just ran out? Yeah, I think. Okay. Can I touch it? Yeah. What bee is that? It's just a honeybee. Good evening, boss. Good evening. Or hmm. Rachel. I'm Rachel. I'm not. I'm <laughs> okay, I'm discombobbled because we're getting ready to go on a trip all the way to the beach. Yeah, so I'm Rachel. And I'm Carl. And, you're and that's watching. Chase behind us. And you're watching Happy's Family. So, like Carl said, we are getting ready to drop our daughter off in Greenville. And then we are going to take a trip to the beach. Yes. New Bern. New Again, right? back are to where excited? we went. Yes. Oh, yeah. Well, we are going to be back here before yeah, we go back we to the beach Yeah, we are in between, yes. So in, follow us on our trip to drop her off at college, and we'll see how well this goes. Are you guys going to get ready to watch me cry? You're going to cry, you think? Oh, I'm sure I'm going to cry. I might you even might cry, even, guys. Yeah, I was yeah, going to say, definitely. you might even cry. So, but, All right, well, we appreciate you guys watching. So, and we're going to get on the road. Yeah. Because there is rain coming. Look at that rain, Chef. You know we're driving into that, right? Fun. Right. Yeah. Are you ready? No, not really. Are you ready? I think, are, were we procrastinating for a reason? Because we didn't want to send our kid off to the real Maybe, world? Maybe. Do you think so? Maybe. Oh, boy. I hope Even we're... Chase said, yeah, I want to keep her. You want to keep her, Chase? Okay. Well, you have two. Look, mm -hmm. why couldn't we have nice over there up to where we want to go? Everywhere we want to go, it's going to pour down rain uh -huh. probably. Man, that's a really ominous looking cloud, ain't it?
from the border of Tennessee, right by the edge of where the, there's a little town in Tennessee, on the edge of North Carolina and the mountain, back at the west, the furthest west. Mm -hmm. From there, all the way to the Outer Banks, if you were to drive from front to that side to that side, it's eight hours, and it's either eight hours and 53 minutes or nine hours and 53 minutes. Yeah, it's a long way across like different states and stuff. So we're going down the pass. Here we are. We are on our way to ECU. Good morning, Kayla. Good morning. <laughs> Carl is in the truck ahead of us and um, he has all her stuff. And I'm surprised I'm not crying as I'm talking because- Well, you're getting there. <laughs> you can hear it in your voice. I've already done it a couple times. See, <laughs> told you. I know. Cry, so you can. Super excited about this. <laughs> right? <laughs> so come on our journey to have a freshman move in. So guys, I think we're almost there in Greenville. Now it's only me, Rachel, and Kayla. The rest of the kids are at my parents' house. And that was fun. Rachel was already When Chase said bye, Rachel was already tearing up, so this should be fun. Okay guys, we're almost there. When we get there, we'll see how um, everything goes. I think I gotta put stuff together. Hopefully that goes well, but and then we're gonna head back home after we drop her off, back all the way to the mountains, so. Let's get this going. So this is the medical, this yes. is ECU Medical that's the, no, that's Health, health Science, science campus. campus. So what's the Health Science Campus? So like if you're doing nursing, um, physical, or um, therapy, physical therapy, stuff like that. And then the medical school is down there too. Oh yeah, that's the medical school. So I could yeah. possibly be going there for mm -hmm. an additional four years if I decide to go. Oh my goodness, here we are. We're so close. The 
Kayla, are you excited? Yes, I am. It's going to be weird, but... Yeah. The next chapter of your life. You I recorded a little bit and I started crying. You did? Yeah. So where are we at? Didn't I, Kayla? We're at Kayla's college. Here we are. So that's the second time you cried today. Oh, more than that, I think. It's going to be more than the second time. This is a nice little area, right? Yeah. A little sitting table. <laughs> Kayla doesn't know where she's going. You know, this, this is the green residence hall. So this. Why don't you go ask the staff over there? We need to find the little pirate guy for that. So that I can show off my pirate's mom shirt. Your pirate's mom shirt? Are we geeks? Are, are you embarrassed to be here with us? Oh, I guess you better get a bicycle. I know. You should have just... You didn't even need a car. Why did I buy you a car? So that I could go to the hospital and not have to bike on the dangerous street. Oh, okay. That's a good, uh, good one. Oh, yeah. It says West End Dining Hall right there. Yeah. Are you excited? We have to get all this up there, guys. <laughs> Way up there on Actually, that on the eighth floor. <laughs> on the other side. No, we're going through that door. Yeah, we are going through that door. But my, build, my room's on the other side of the building. Yeah, but we'll be able to get <laughs> up there easy, hopefully. So we're going to go ahead and get this done. And Man, you get a high up view up here, guys. Isn't it pretty? Yeah, it is pretty. And At least. Windowsill is perfect for all my plants. Yeah. Cool. Nice green space down there. When they're mowing, it can remind you of me and mommy. Yeah. <laughs> okay, can we turn the air conditioner on? It's kind of hot in here. <laughs> Carl's tired. I just wrestled with the elevator <laughs> and the dog. <laughs> and we really, really should have been recording <laughs> because it was crazy. But So we got most of our stuff in. We're going to start getting it all unpacked now, I guess, and Ooh. getting her settled. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? Eh, I don't like building things. I, okay. I like building things, but building them when I can build them my way. I don't like following instructions. You don't like following instructions. No. But this is a little um, cabinet, another cabinet for Kayla. It's like a microwave cart. I don't know if they're going to put their microwave on it or if they're just going to use it to store food, but... You'll see the microwave. Yeah. Cool. Kayla will have to show us a dorm tour when she's all moved in. Now it's just chaos. Every Carl said, does everybody take this much to college? I think so. This is our first time, so we really don't know. What do you think, Kayla? I don't know. It's my first time, so... <laughs> I mean, we everyone need, else looks like they brought this much stuff. We need all of it, right? Yeah, it's all important. I mean, Especially my 15 million blankets that I have. Exactly. And you <laughs> can't live in a college dorm without some plants, right? So we have the money tree that we got her. She's requesting a bigger pot, though, so I think we're going to bring her a bigger pot. And then she has all her little... Um, Your, oh, your aloe. Yeah. It's too top heavy, you think? Yeah. Oh, yeah, maybe. Man, guys, we are high up. There's my truck and Kayla's car. We're just about done moving around. Look at the storm out there. Oh, man, you can see all kinds of storms up here. You ready for this? No. You got it. We're dropping Kayla off and we're going to be leaving her. But I know, we didn't find the pirate though, so I guess we're going to have to find the pirate when we bring the kids back, right? Eventually, yeah. So, okay, let's go drop her off and leave. Yeah. Oh, I'm recording. <laughs> okay, we'll just take some pictures off the recording. You're so. like, leave me alone. Why, am I going to embarrass you? No. Okay, let's go drop her off and go. Guys, Rachel's sad. Not sad. I'm happy and excited for her. Got this. So we're leaving Kayla for the first time in 18 years. And it's going to be weird for me. Yeah. You'll have fun. Yeah. Get smarter. Stay in college and learn more knowledge. 
Really? Be the first one in the family that's a doctor, right? Yeah, that would be awesome. Really yeah. happy. I'm sorry, dear. I know. Oh my gosh, it's a you good guys thing. It's are a good thing. definitely seeing the real me. Ooh. This we'll see her hard. again in two days and we'll talk to her again. This is really hard though. We got this, right? Yeah. She's going to do great things. No, and I'm so proud of her and I want her to do this. I'm like excited. I'm, I'm a pirate's mom now. <laughs> and I'm a pirate's dad now. Yeah. So. Um, which is hard. Yeah, definitely hard. But she's in a good place. She'll learn and do good, right? Oh man, she's going to do so good. I do know this. I mean, she's already done so good that she got this completely paid for. Um, so. And we're just, uh, Rachel is a little worried with the other kids too. Um, it's a big change for all of us. Even yeah. like Chase, he again today was like, I guess just realized that it was the last time he was going to see her. But we're going to do pen pals with her and Chase. Yeah. She's going to write him letters and we're going to have him write letters back for school. Yeah. So we're going to make, make it fun. So. Yeah. I mean, you guys got to understand, Kayla did a lot for us. Kayla was cooking dinner. Kayla was doing dishes and raising the other kids. Well, helping us raise the other kids while we were doing the lawn care and landscaping. I mean, like, yeah, we are, we have our own business and we're very flexible, but we did, we depended on Kayla a lot because she's our 18 year old. Mm -hmm. um, and she's been doing this since I've come and started working full time in 2017. Um, with Carl so you know she's been doing this this is gonna be just as much of a change I think for her as it is for us I think for every everyone we're really close um, yeah all of us so I know you guys might call us weird um, <laughs> and that's okay <laughs> I almost cried I didn't cry though I yeah. almost did but there's a tear I've there. I've broken down a couple times I'm and I'm sure when you see her again when we come because we're going we got to go pick up my my, oh, my kid. we got to go <laughs> pick up the rest of the kids from my mom's house who good for us lives only 40 minutes away yeah. 45 minutes away yeah. that's a benefit yeah and then sure. we're gonna drive all the way back to Asheville so we got here last night yeah and we're driving all the way back to Asheville tonight yeah. and then we're gonna go stay there for a couple days and then we're gonna come back here to um go to New Bern, the beach, and then meet up with Kayla again one last time. Yeah. But we're, the good thing about us versus so a lot- so proud of her Yes, though. we're I definitely so proud of her. And the good thing about us, a good thing about the time we're in now is that we have FaceTime. We have Zoom. Yeah, I, my goodness, Back I don't even know. Yeah, and I mean, like, I remember going through this when we were, we were buying a house. <laughs> at this age we were buying a house at this age and my mom was moving to florida so i mean i remember when you, you guys know. want to hear something else when i left for the marine corps oh, rachel yeah. bald and we were only dating for like seven months then right? yeah rachel i didn't bald. expect i'm very emotional i guess <laughs> very sensitive but yeah i didn't expect that but i did i fell hard and deep for Carl. <laughs> and we're together now 25 years so we're gonna go get the kids we're gonna head back to Asheville and we'll let you know how much rain we got a friend texted me a picture and yeah. he said just last night before we left we got an inch and a half at my house and then he said after we left just last night I think it was over four inches of rain that's crazy yeah he and, said, and that, more coming and that's not even the storm today, yeah. that, that was just the cold front pushing through um, and now there's tropical storms coming up. And so I think it's supposed to rain all day today, all day tomorrow. Yeah, so we'll crazy. see how big my gauge is when we get back. How so I guess it was a good thing that we, you know, we are getting rain. So, but we're just going to be so terribly be behind. Because everything's going to grow. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's going to grow with that much rain and cool temperatures for the next four or five days. But this is what happens, you guys. Yeah. When you go somewhere, <laughs> it bites you in the butt when you yeah. come back. But we got it. We yeah. got it. And all our clients are amazing people. So yeah, they sure. understand. So let's go ahead and get back and get the kids and get this on the road. All right. Yeah. Get we're home getting home 11, late, man. We're, yeah, we're getting home late. But... Well, if we leave at six, we can be home by 11. All right, let's go. But it takes us a half hour to get to my mom's. So. <laughs> so we're on our way home without Kayla. We have the other children's in the back. Oh, you can't see Jared. 
but and then the dogs are all the way in the back of course but it looks like we're about to go into lots of rain yeah i don't want that but we are dropping and driving into that tropical system coming up into the mountain yeah look at it so we were trying to look for a duncan too this is going to be a late night what are we i think 11 35 or 11 32 we're at now so by the time we probably stop for gas and all that, it probably is going to be like midnight, midnight, midnight. But as you can see, that's why we're taking off the full week this week. Because we got to make this drive again. Yes, we have to make this drive again to come back. I mean, we don't have to make the drive again. This is our choice to do this for our kids um, so that they can have a little vacation before. Yes, before the September schooling starts and they don't have their sister to <laughs> fend for them anymore, right? I know, but now, now mommy's going to have to start cooking again. Do you think that you'll like mommy's food? Yeah. Yeah, because Kayla learned from me. <laughs> 